So now we're dialing in our prep. I'm trying to set it up so I can be more efficient on set. I like to label my lens case and label these little magic beauties inside. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna put a tag on each case, tell me what lens each lens is. So when my second AC has to grab it, it makes it quick and efficient. He's not picking up the lens and trying to search. Even though it's easy to see what lens I'm holding, if it's on top of the lens right here, it says 100 mil, and then I put my lens stops on there, I can put what the close focus on the lens is and what the T-stop is on the lens. So when the DP asks, oh, we need to do a tight shot, I need 100 mil, what's the minimum focus? My AC doesn't have to pick up the lens and check it. It's already written on top of the lens. And I'm gonna do one even better. I'm gonna put it on top of the case. Little tip for my second ACs. A case is either open and unlocked or it's closed with the latches. Minimum one latch. Never leave a lens case unlocked and open because all that's gonna happen is someone's gonna walk by, grab the handle and now you have $100,000 on the floor. That's not gonna be a good thing. So remember, lens cases locked and closed, save yourself the hassle. All right, let's label this case. So first off, I'm gonna start on the top, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my two inch red tape, just cause it pops, and red is beautiful, and it just stands out a little bit. When you're looking at the lenses, you can see them from far away. It just helps everybody see it. And during project time, you wanna make it as neat as possible. Have fun with it. It's arts and crafts time. This is where you get to shine a little bit and show your artistic creativity. Do something fun. Let me see what you guys come up with. Send me some pictures. I love to see pictures of other ideas. I have two sets of lenses, so I'm gonna put a tag on the top for one row. Tag on the bottom. I want it to be nice and neat. So when my AC looks at it, he appreciates the work that's done also. And to make it extra clean, I could write it with a Sharpie. I'm gonna make this look special. Oh, look at that, the P-Touch. But you know what? I saw my second AC do something and I never did it before. So I'm gonna have a little bit more fun and I'm gonna make this a little bit more creative. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna take this white gaffer's tape and I'm gonna make a strip in the center and then I'm gonna P-Touch it. When I'm done, you're gonna see how detailed this is and you're gonna understand how efficient this is gonna make me on set and it just looks awesome. During my prep, my ACs will come in and teach themselves. They're pre-training, they're learning the way I like things. And also, if you work in the rental house, this is something you can do to impress your first AC, to get out on his jobs. If he's by himself at a prep, and you hop down and you label cases, I'm gonna tell you one thing, I'm gonna try to get you out on my jobs because I see your hustle. Awesome. All right, let's start labeling some lenses. So we're gonna crack open our case and let's see what lenses we have so we can put them into our P-Touch. I have a, starting with a 21 mil to a 50 mil. So what's happening now is my lenses are not in the case organized the way I would like them to be. So I'm gonna go ahead and organize my lens case before I start labeling them. And I wanna start from my widest lens to go to my tightest lens. All right, so I have 21, I know I have a 25, it got mixed up over here, so I'm gonna take my 25 out. I'm gonna shift my 100 mil over. I'm gonna take my 85, my 50 out, put my 25 where it needs to be. I'm gonna take my 85 out, put my 50 where it needs to be. I'm gonna pull my 100 back out, put the 85 where it needs to be, and I'm gonna put my 100 down. It's kinda like Vegas, huh? Did you guys see where, what? Can you find the ball? All right, so now I know all my lenses. I have a 21, a 25, a 50, a 85, and a 100. Now I can tag the top of my case with ease. Oh, look at those colors. And you hear those locks going down, correct? All right, so let's get to, to printing out some labels. Having a P-Touch is one of those tools where spending $25 is really gonna save you. And it looks a lot cleaner on set. You're gonna P-Touch your slates, you're gonna P-Touch your gear, you're gonna P-Touch everything, and your AC will appreciate you. Your crew will appreciate you. So. Spend the $25, get a P-Touch. It's not gonna hurt you. 
All right, let's get to labeling.